Welcome, dear viewers, to a tale of the night, where shadows whisper and spirits take flight. In New York's embrace, where the stories are rich, lies a brownstone, the house of death, bewitching and bewitched. A place of mystery, where the past does not rest, and the echoes of the departed put the brave to the test. So stay a while and let curiosity unfold, for in this story, the darkest of secrets are told. Prepare for a journey where suspense is the key in the house of death, where nothing is as it seems to be. Keep watching, keep wondering what lies in the dark, for in this haunted tale, the spirits leave their mark. The Brownstone on West 10th. In the heart of the city where the lights dimly glow lies a brownstone shrouded in mysteries untold. A dwelling of darkness with whispers in the walls, the house of death beckons with its ghostly calls. A door creaks open to reveal tales of the past, where shadows linger and the chills are vast. A staircase winds up through the silence it weaves, each step a story that the mind perceives. The air hangs heavy with secrets it keeps as the moonlight through the broken shutter creeps. Mark Twain's spirit in a white suit appears, his unfinished business echoing through the years. The echoes of the 22 who met their fate in this abode of sorrow behind the iron gate, their whispers in the night, a soft, mournful plea, a dance of the dead that the living can see. So tread lightly, dear visitor, keep your wits about, for in the house of death, the spirits never check out. With each creak and moan, feel the suspense rise in this chapter of rhythm, where the past never dies. Mark Twain's Legacy In the silence of the night, when the city sleeps tight, the house of death whispers tales of a ghostly white. A figure emerges from the annals of time, Mark Twain's spirit, in this haunted rhyme. His presence lingers in the rooms where he stayed, a literary giant whose memories never fade. In the quiet of the brownstone where the shadows play, his unfinished business keeps the living at bay. The air grows colder as the story unfolds of a man in white whose tale is told, a specter of history with a mustache and a quip through the corridors, he makes his spectral trip. The walls hold secrets of laughter and despair, of a life once lived and a soul laid bare. The echoes of his footsteps, a soft haunting sound in the house of death where spirits abound. So listen closely as the suspense grows, for in this chapter, the ghostly twain shows. With each line and verse, feel the mystery deepen in this haunted house where the past is still speaking. A century of spirits beneath the moon's pale gaze, where the night's mist creeps, the house of death stands where history seeps. A century of spirits in silence they dwell in the heart of Manhattan, casting their spell. Whispers of the departed, through the dark they weave a tapestry of souls that the living perceive 22 echoes from the void they call in the house that holds them one and all. The air shivers with stories untold and unseen of lives once vibrant, now part of the scene. A spectral parade in the night they march, their presence a lantern in the brownstone's arch. The sightings, the stories, a chilling embrace of those who've crossed over, leaving but a trace. Their tales intertwine, a haunting refrain in the house of death they forever remain. So hold your breath as the suspense unfurls in this chapter of rhythm where the other world swirls. With each verse and shadow, feel the past revive in this haunted house where the spirits strive. The mother-daughter encounter. In the depths of the night where the shadows hold sway, the house of death murmurs of a time far away. A mother and daughter in the 1930s gloom face the ghost of Mark Twain in the twilight's bloom. A specter in white with a message to impart. His words a riddle 
striking fear in the heart. I have unfinished business, the apparition spoke, in the silent brownstone where the past awoke. The encounter, a tale that would long persist, in the annals of the haunted through the fog and mist, their lives forever altered by the ghostly scene, in the house where the veil between worlds is thin, the legend grew larger, with each telling in here, the suspense palpable as the spirits draw near, a chapter of rhythm where the past and present blend, in the house of death, where the stories never end. So brace for the chills as the suspense takes hold, in this rhythmic tale where the eerie unfolds. With each line and whisper, feel the tension rise in this haunted chapter where the mystery lies. Paranormal Investigations When the clock strikes midnight and the world's hushed and still, the house of death awakens with stories to spill. Investigators flock, with gadgets in hand, to unravel the secrets that this house demands. In the quest for the truth, where the unseen is sout, the air crackles with energy, the evidence fraught. Recorders capture whispers from lips unseen and cameras flash where shadows have been. The skeptics and believers together they tread through the haunted halls filled with dread, seeking answers in the night's embrace in the house of death where the past leaves its trace. The findings are mixed, some chilling to the bone of voices from the void in a somber tone. The data collected a puzzle to peace in this chapter of rhythm where the hauntings never cease. So feel the suspense as it thickens the air in this rhythmic narrative of a house laid bare. With each stanza and verse, let the mystery entwine in this haunted chapter where the paranormal shines, the house today. As dawn breaks the silence and night's veil retreats, the house of death stirs in the bustling streets. A relic of terror, in the daylight it stands, holding secrets of the night in its ghostly hands. The current residents with stories to share. Speak of eerie encounters that catch them unaware. Footsteps in the hallway when no one is there, and cold spots in rooms that make the bravest beware. Interviews with the living, Add layers to the lore of a house that's alive with the echoes of yore. The spirits, they say, are never too far in the house of death where the haunted are. The house now a legend on tours it's displayed where the curious and brave have their fears unswayed. A chapter of rhythm where the past and now merge in the house of death as the spirits surge. So let the suspense linger like a fog in the air in this rhythmic tale of a house laid bare. With each line and shadow, let the mystery unfold in this haunted chapter where the stories are told beyond the house of death. In the city that never sleeps, where tales are spun, the house of death is not the only one. A chapter unfolds where the spirits roam free in the shadows of New York, where they long to be. From the alleys of Manhattan to the shores of the Isle. The haunted whispers carry on for mile after mile. Other houses, other stories in the dead of the night, where the past lingers on just out of sight. The suspense builds as the tales intertwine of spirits and legends in the city's design. A world beyond the brownstone where the haunted play in the rhythm of the night till the break of day. So venture, if you dare, into the unknown, where the stories of the dead are etched in stone. A chapter of rhythm where the suspense never ends, in the city of ghosts, where the veil always bends. With each verse and shadow, let the mystery call, in this haunted chapter, where the spirits enthrall. Feel the suspense as it dances with fear in the rhythm of the night where the ghosts are near. In whispers soft and shadows deep, the house of death its secrets keep. A tale that's told, a door ajar, a world where spirits linger far.
The final chapter, softly spoken, leaves the thread of fate unbroken. In New York's heart, the brownstone stands, a monument to ghostly hands. For seekers bold who dare to tread, where echoes of the past are wed, beware the call, the haunting plea of stories locked in mystery. So ends our tale, but not the lore. The house of death has much in store. A cycle endless, a history spun in the city that sleeps for none. The end, a pause, a subtle bend in haunted tales that never end. The house of death will always be a beacon for eternity.